Let's play ball. Here's a look at the team scaring up to do battle in the inaugural Prime Minister's Cup. Passing by the Dighton Griffith School in Christchurch, we spotted some men hard at training in the blazing sun. So we stopped in and realized it was a team from Watton FC. Watton is one of the teams that booked an early place in the round of 16. And coach Andre Phillips said it was not all smooth sailing to get there. We've been training basically from early July. So it started off a bit slow as we go on, the numbers going up. We started off the tournament with a loss, but since that, two back-to-back -back wings, picking up a little head of steam and working towards the round of 16 next. So our opponent is Parish Line, so that is what we are working towards right now, one game at a time. Knowing that we're getting into the true business end of things for the tournament, there's some key areas the Watton team is focused on. As you all know, unity is strength, and if you want to win $100,000, everybody needs to be together. We need to have a plan going forward, and we need to execute the plan together as one team. So that is my biggest problem in, in terms of anything is to build the togetherness, so that is what I'm really working towards, building unity, strength, and togetherness in the dressing room. The fellas had a little time to rest this week after a tough weekend last week in the group stage. So we just come out and we come now, we try to run off a little steam, work off and now we're here working on a bit formation and defensive drills. We can go into some set plays, defending corners and that kind of stuff. No better way can a coach lead but by example. And that is just where Coach Phillips can be found, training with his men. Just to let them see that you know you are just like them, you know what I mean? You're just not telling them to do things that you can't do. So if I want my guys to run hard, I want to be in front of you like running as hard, so we give them the encouragement to say, well, look, coach, running hard. Let me run hard behind coach. You know what I mean? That's just my way. I'm probably the youngest coach in Premier League in Barbados right now. So, yeah, it's just my way I like to get involved. And he's a homegrown Watton man. I mean, basically, I've been coaching now from, from the time I was a teenager. I went to St. Leonard's Boys. I was doing it from on the Astro for like going to games on the evening, that kind of stuff. Grew up playing for Gore Hill Youth Football Team. So I was doing it from there. So like, basically I had a lot of good mentors. Like, I always liked the coaching part of the game. So from young, it was something I was doing from young. I had my first certificate so when I was a teenager. Um, so basically, Watton is where I'm from. I used to play for Gore Hill. But Watton is where I'm from. And is my plan and in my thing. So it was all my dream to see Watton go to Premier League and try now towards winning something major with Warren. Warren as a club, one as a community, where I born and grew up. So while Coach Phillips leads in training and readiness, on the field of play, Keon Harden leads as captain. All we need to do is work for each other and play together. Keep possession of the football and put away our chances. Um, the management and some of the players are saying the defense has leaked too much goals, but Everybody got a job to do. The defense got to clean up itself. And we know what we got to do going forward. So looking ahead, Watton is set to face Parish Land in their upcoming round of 16 match. All in the push to be crowned inaugural Prime Minister's Cup champion. That was Let's Play Ball. We just got some insight into the team scaring up for the inaugural Prime Minister's Cup.